What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of American Truck Simulator. Oh. Well, if I could. There we go. So today I've got a great truck for you today. It's another part of the truck showcase. Uh, we have the freight lighter Argosy. 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 Whatever you want to call it. Um, but we're just checking out the dash here. Do we have an interior light? It appears we do. So it's got the lit up dash air. As you can see, we've got us a clutch. We've got a manual transmission. We've got GPS in here. Uh, we got a dash here. Windows. All that great stuff. So let's start it up. And this is, I'm in the garage, so we have Doppler effect. I've got a cat. I've got a uh, Cummins IX IX50 under the hood, 550 horsepower. I think. Listen to the horn on this. sunshine and F3 that right so let's get into it so we are currently in port we're back in Portland so today We will take a trailer of office supplies down to Flagstaff. Gonna be a bit of a long haul today. have traffic coming down here. I'm gonna watch that left side. Poke out a little bit. I'm going. One thing I like about these cab is they can turn on the dime. on there. Whoa. Got a bit of lag going on here. I also have a new box truck mod in over on here, so that's good. It's got a fairly fast indicator on it. Dang it, I got that confused. This is probably my dream truck to drive in ATS because I love cab overs. sun in our face. Oh, it won't be that way for long because we'll be heading we'll be heading west, so it should be alright. Down there. 
So this Saturday is when uh, I will have my second meet with the Country Rail Fan. Uh, this time we'll be out rail fanning the C&O and TP main line of Norfolk Southern. Get over in the lane, left lane here. Get over one more. Got a cardinal truck. this exit going toward the dullies so we got to go eastbound I bet you it's gonna take us down to the docks and where we're picking up I bet so there's downtown Portland over there to my right I'm watching them doing bridge here. It's got a nice jake break too. Move on buddy. Buddy you're doing 50 in a 60 zone. What is up with you? That's a ZMX, I think, or MKX, I can't remember. It's a one of those Subarus I really like because they're fast. Take a, a Dodge Dart and imagine that as a Subaru, except it's a hatchback, and that's what you get when you get one of those. An RMX. A, a ZR? I can't remember. Anyway, how you guys been doing on this fine Tuesday evening? I think this will be, this will be uploaded, maybe Wednesday. Only a 25 through here. 
645, there we go. Yep, we're going to the airport. Getting over here. Crossing lights do not know what to do there. That's a, that's funny. That is funny. Got a Honda Fit over there. There goes a Ford Taurus. I like Ford Tauruses. They're nice. It's probably about maybe a 2010, maybe. Ah, uh, Pete. Whoa, buddy. Man, he was flying. I like those Pete Day calves. They're pretty. Yep, we're going to the airport. <laughs> he's probably making a delivery to the airport. Because he's got a container. I stopped. I don't know though. They may not be. Oh, look at this! Look at this! It's it's a tram. That's cool. Bit of rail fan in there, folks. So we're gonna be turning left here because that goes back toward the uh, unloading area. Portland Cargo. Let's see here what our options are. We need to do a long trip anyway because we're a bit short of money. Uh, our options... Oh. Oh, great. Well, we made it this far. I guess we'll take this load to Port C uh, Salt Lake City. Let's see here. Do we have anything in here? No. Uh. Those wouldn't go in a dry band. They'd be a bit bulky. Take it on a flatbed. Taking us a aircraft engine. Oh, hey, got a peep. Oh, that is a beautiful 380. That's a that's a pretty truck. Well, we get the wrong way. There's a there's a D, there's some DC tens. Not sure what airline they are, but there we go. Our load is over on the other side. Those are probably uh, offload trailers. Loads that are ready to go out are is this us? So I see a line right there. Yep, there's our trailer. Go ahead and get our flashers on. I 
need to get over a little bit. So I'm way too close to hydro. And watch it right there. I think we're gonna miss it. Yeah, we missed it. Alright, good. Now so stone tires on it. This truck. I'm 
me get up to 60. Got a 60 mile an hour. That's something in Oregon. Yeah, that looks nice. I like that. I like that. Should have went with the spread axle, but oh well. Guess what it is. I didn't want to go as far as far south as Salt Lake City, but we can. It doesn't matter. I don't think you guys will mind. That means we get to go on a that much more of a drive together. But yeah, going through this beautiful tunnel here. I love doing that in tunnels. It's just fun. Oh hey, there's a railroad track right between the road. Oop. Gotta stop. Get the turn lane here. Whoa. Jeez. I know where I'd stop the scale. Thank you.
gonna be going uphill out of Bend. Oregon's kind of a very hilly state, but it's also a very beautiful state, so yeah. 45 mile an hour. You know we're gonna be doing the speed limit. said we're going up a fair bit of hill here there's a winery over to our left more of it well, that's houses to our, our right winery on the right houses on the left Whoa. glad that Prius passed me he's I don't know where he's going Whoa. hello Big lags by a gear. Please don't crash on me. Please don't. What's it doing? Let's see here. This is not good. There's obviously something here it does not like. Whoa. And it crashed. <sighs> well, shoot. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this video. If you enjoy, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Have a good one. Peace out.